Hello, welcome to my channel. If you love biographies or history, leave a like. Now let's get back to the video. Isaac Pittman, born on January 4, 1813, in Trowbridge, Wiltshire, England, emerged as a transformative figure in the realms of shorthand writing and education. His innovative contributions particularly the development of Pittman shorthand, revolutionized communication, and laid the foundation for modern shorthand systems. Pittman's early life was marked by a passion for self-improvement and education. Despite facing financial challenges, he was largely self-taught and developed a keen interest in phonetics and spelling reform. These early influences would later shape his groundbreaking work in shorthand. Writing in 1837, Pittman introduced the first version of Pittman shorthand, a system designed to represent the sounds of speech with symbols, allowing for faster and more efficient note-taking. This invention marked a significant departure from existing shorthand methods and quickly gained popularity for its simplicity and practicality. Titman's commitment to education extended beyond shorthand. He advocated for spelling reform, promoting a phonetic approach to teaching and learning. His influential textbook, Phonography, became a cornerstone in the dissemination of Pittman's shorthand and contributed to the broader movement for educational reform. The success of Pittman's shorthand transcended national borders. It became widely adopted in the United Kingdom and the United States, influencing business communication, journalism, and secretarial work Pittman's system became the standard for shorthand instruction, and its principles continue to be taught and used worldwide. In addition to his contributions to shorthand, Pittman played a pivotal role in educational reform. He established the first correspondence college in the world, offering education through postal courses this innovation made education more accessible to a broader audience, laying the groundwork for distance learning methodologies. Isaac Pittman's legacy goes beyond the realms of shorthand and education. His advocacy for spelling reform and his commitment to accessible education reflected a progressive vision for the democratization of knowledge Pittman's impact is evident in the continued use of his shorthand system and the enduring influence of his educational initiatives. Pittman's later years were marked by international recognition. For his contributions, he received awards and honors for his work in shorthand and education, including a medal from the French government. Pittman's commitment to improving communication and education left an indelible mark in linguistic and pedagogical landscapes. Isaac Pittman passed away on January 12, 1897, but his legacy endures. Pittman's shorthand remains an integral part of shorthand history, and his contributions to educational reform have left an enduring impact on teaching and learning methodologies. Pittman's life and work stand as a testament to the transformative power of innovative thinking and a dedication to improving communication and education for generations to come. Thank you for watching. Please leave a like and a sub.